welcome to the Hacienda Rivet here. Uh, today we are continuing our Hot Condiment International Culinary Odyssey and we're flying from uh, uh, Yucatan and the Mayans which we made the other day all the way to the Balkans in north of Greece and we're gonna make Ajvar which is a uh, condiment based on eggplant and bell peppers now uh, the Balkan regions is uh, region is comprised of Albania uh, Croatia Macedonia uh, Bosnia Herzegovina um, all that so that's that's the area north of Greece anyway um, every country has their version of Ashvar the Macedonian version is characterized by being fiery hot and that's the one we're gonna make now I couldn't find any regular red hot peppers so we got uh, habaneros so we're gonna add the heat with those we got some fresh garlic red bell peppers now strangely enough I was looking at the sticker on these peppers. They come from Holland. I, I don't know why in the central United States we're getting red bell peppers from Holland, but we got them. Anyway, we got eggplant, two pounds, so that's uh, one pound each. And this recipe comes from the Hot Sauce Cookbook by Rob Walsh. Uh, that cookbook was given to me by uh, my daughter-in-law and her husband for Christmas uh, a couple years back, and it is fantastic. We've also got some olive oil, and in this case, we've got Greek olive oil, so that's going to work out really well. Now, uh, this condiment is served two ways. It's served as a dip with pita bread or crackers, or it is served as a condiment on top of meat sandwiches. We are going to have meat sandwiches today as well. Hebrew National, 100% beef franks. We're going to grill those out there too. And uh, we're going to try this condiment both as a dip and on the hot dog. So stay with me and I'll show you how it's done. All right, we got a good char on the, uh, on the vegetables. They were over charcoal and uh, a chunk of apple wood. So now we're going to wrap them up and uh, let them cool off so we can peel the skin. All right, so now we got all the... Uh, vegetables peeled we've got half a cup of olive oil in a hot pan and uh, first thing is we're gonna add the chopped garlic followed by a dozen uh, quartered habaneros now we're gonna turn this down to medium now we're gonna add the cubed up uh, eggplant by the way this smells delicious followed by the red bell pepper. And we're just gonna saute this for a while over medium heat and get everything incorporated and softened. Right. Now after uh, <clears throat> 20 minutes of cooking, 25 minutes, we're gonna add two tablespoons of kosher salt and one tablespoon of coarse ground black pepper. Uh, we're gonna let them cool, um, <clears throat> then pulse everything in batches in the food processor and then combine it, mix it all well, and I'll uh, show you how it turns okay, out. Okay, it took five or six batches, um, and the final touch is the juice of one lime. Uh, actually, you're supposed to use lemon, but I didn't have a lemon, I got a lime, so that's what we're doing. Here we have it in a bowl, and uh, we're gonna try it as a dip. I have a regular Triscuit here, uh, the original flavor, and let's see what it's like. Mmm, oh my. The roasted flavor comes through very well. Nice roasted red bell pepper. A little bit of garlic. Wow, talk about fiery hot. Woo, it is. But cooking the habaneros uh, took down the heat, so it is palatable. Um, a lot of great flavor here. Definitely make again. And uh, wow, let's put together our hot dog. And here we have the uh, grilled Hebrew National all beef hot dog and we are going to put a little bit of sauerkraut on that baby right like that and now we're gonna put some Aj Ajvar Macedonian condiment maybe a little bit more it's that good yum alright and there you have it thanks for watching people bye bye